see you. Okay. Ah, cookies. I mean, I don't know anybody who can walk past a cookie jar like nobody. Some people can if they've got very great self-control, but most people can't, can My they? Kids love them. They, uh, well, I've got those big glass jars at home, and then well, last night they was arguing over a piece of Victoria sandwich because really? the cookies were all gone. So <laughs> it was. So uh, you had to make some more. Yeah. <laughs> What's the history of the cookie? I mean, you know, we've always we always used to call them biscuits in this country. It's very much an American thing. Cookies. I think it came from some. They used to test the cake mixture in the oven and. Basically, it was a happy, uh, you know, oh, happy accident. Mis yeah, really. accident, basically. Oh, right. Now, you're going to do two kinds of cookies yep. for us. I've got to show them your book, because it's, <laughs> it's if, you, if you love baking... Oh, what have I just done? Is that me? <laughs> Something's fallen off. It's probably my leg after doing all that uh, <laughs> ganging and body popping. <laughs> so this is it. So if you want to get yourself sorted out with um, baking, a passion for baking is Joan. She's certainly got one. We saw you on Great British Bake Off. You were passionate. Yep. Tell us what we're going to do. Peanut butter cookies? We're going to do peanut butter okay. cookies, which I've been doing for about 25 years. Oh, my kids. 25 just... years. Have you got it right yet? Well, my, yeah, just about, I Your think. Your kids say, yeah. <laughs> well, the kids think I have, yeah. So we've got some Butter softened butter first. in there. Yeah. And I've got some um, demerara sugar, which makes it real, gives it a nice caramelly flavour. Yeah. And then I've got some caster sugar, because that gives it the texture and the crunch, and just give that mix together. The nice thing about cooking in the studio is your butter always melts so beautifully. Nice and soft there, yeah. Nice, really. So, so we'll just so get that, that mixed through. Around. And then um, I'm going to add some peanut butter. Right. I like the crunchy one, but you can use the smooth one as well. well. I think the crunchy one's quite good in cookies, isn't it? Yep, it gives them a nicer texture. Yeah. So literally, just want to give that a good stir through. Do you want me to do it? You, do you want to go? You go, you, you got, I've got an egg, isn't it? Oh, we've got an egg. Well, you do tell next. me what's going yep. in. I'm, just, I'm not as good at this. So we've got an egg. One well, earth. Mix in. And if we okay. had a bit more time, we'd. Uh, yeah. And then I've got some baking powder and some bicarb to go in there, and that just gives them gives them a nice light texture. Now, is that what baking powder does? Is, it does. Does that give them a sort of lift? But you don't want to use too much bicarb because that gives it horrible, gives it the acid taste. Oh, so, so if too much and the flavour comes yeah. through. Okay. So and then we've just got some peanuts. Oh, real to add peanuts in, in there. Some real peanuts. Okay. And if you want a real nice treat, you can just add. And um, once you've laid them out, just stick a square of chocolate on the top. But I'm, I want one of these now. Stopped eating chocolate. That was my New Year's resolution so for the first of April. Eat peanuts instead. <laughs> so I'm so eating pe too many cookies instead. Well, I've done that. What Perfect. are you doing now? You've done a really good job there. Right. So you just want it. It's like we've got they grease say, proof. Are you using that one or this yep. one? That one. So, so we've got grease proof. Oh, you got an ice cream scoop. Yep, an ice cream scoop just gives you um, gives you a, a uniformity in your oh, cookies, so you get all same one size. size. And also, another thing, what I do is with my cookies, you know you want them to be that real soft in the centre and crunchy on the outside. If you cook them halfway through, yeah. then just give them a really sharp tack yeah. halfway through baking on the surface with a tea towel. You, they, it dispels, dispels the air, and so you get that really nice crunch on the oh, outside yeah. and soft on the inside. And they go in the oven for how long? They go in the oven at 170 for about 15 minutes. Quite think. quick, then? Yep, yep. So, and then the next one's... Chocolate chip. Chocolate oh, you chip, see this. Which oh. is apparently our favourite in the one weakness <laughs> <laughs> out of 53. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so, more melted butter. More melted butter. You, do you want it, shall I? Yep, yeah, yeah, do you want to go with that? You... So this time we've got some demerara okay. and some soft brown sugar. Oh, oh demerara and soft brown yep, this time. Shall I it. pull that out? Oh. There we go. Oh, oh. oh yes, one lump or two. not that soft. <laughs> <laughs> soft. And right. I use... Um, I buy bars of chocolate and chop them up because the um, the chocolate chips that you buy seem yeah. to have they've got a coating on them and you get that horrible sort of texture with them that stops them melting. So if you use chopped up chocolate opposed to the uh, the other type, yeah. that we'll make. you get a nicer texture, I think. So you want two oh, eggs. Oh, two in eggs there. in the chocolate yep. chip one. This is a big batch. Okay. All right, getting going. Suit's looking good. Should have put the penny on. Yes. Right. <laughs> well, I never know how yeah. people manage to keep clean, but now I know. You just get <laughs> to do it. Oh, yeah. Hang on, we haven't got the end of it yet. <laughs> Leaning out here. There's a lot of, what, there lot of a flour, lot of flour going flour in, going in, in there. there. Yeah. I, I think that might be, that there might may be have too been much, two there. I think yes. there might. So, and then Should chocolate I chip. Show? I think you better give that a Because, <laughs> frankly, my arm's falling off. Well, this is why I want a pattern dress. I can't I get see any... it. Yeah. I'll tell you what, it's harder work doing this than body popping. <laughs> yeah. well, it's oh, good for the old bingo to... wings. <laughs> <laughs> you so, haven't got any well, chips. That's obviously one. <laughs> chocolate chips in. Chocolate chips. So the same thing, presumably, here with yeah, these. Yeah, and then that's you it. Do and then you use the cookie and, d and yeah. do the bang. With all cookies, if you give them a bang halfway through a cookie and they spread, and if they don't... if you. Don't hit them hard enough. Yeah. You can just hit them down with a fish slice, basically. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> and just, uh, 
Yeah. <laughs> so, and that's um, the same. Anybody like to taste a cookie? Would you like to come up to... Come on. I always feel guilty. Come... Big hand for our two guinea pigs here. Lovely to see you. Hi. Hi. Come in. Come and stand around here, face the audience. Now, we've got here... Joe. which is your favourite, peanut or chocolate? Well, probably peanut at the Pe moment. You can choose which. or try <laughs> both. Peanut. peanut. Go for a peanut. And I'll go for the yeah. chocolate. Chocolate. <laughs> so, Joe, you'd rather have a peanut. I would, yes. Yeah. Now, what should you look for in a good cookie? Should they bend a bit? You want a nice crispy bit on oh, the outside and a nice soft, <laughs> nice soft centre. So... Mmm. Mm, nice and chewy. Crispy. You know, the big problem is they always say to eat a biscuit and then... Talk to the audience. <laughs> <laughs> and you spit crumbs, absolutely. Yeah. Mm. Well. <laughs> I, no, I don't wear lip gloss, Teddy. Are you sure? No. <laughs> I'm just naturally it's Natural shiny. <laughs> <laughs> My thanks to our two guinea pigs. Oh, I think we're enjoying can, them. Can we <laughs> take these? Yeah, take them with, yes. We'll give you a few more to take to the other members of the audience. And it's My, quicker to make them than sometimes to, to go and buy them. It is. You know, so if you've got fast. those in. Yeah. And 15 really minutes quickly. in the oven. My thanks. To Joe Weekly. Thank you, Joe. Thank you. Causing a stir in Mr. Selfridge, Ellen Love, actress Zoe Tapper, on playing a showgirl seductress.